Hi, I'm Deborah, And I'm Lawrence. And in this video, we're going to unbox the August 2021 Buddy Box. Um, Buddy Box is produced by the Blurt Organization, which is a UK-based mental health organization. And um, if you like some of the stuff that's in the box or any of the boxes we do a video on, you might want to check their, their online store because they've got everything. They sell things just by themselves, singly, loose. So... Mm. And I guess the theme is a recipe for rest. And on the back, it's a self-care bingo. Cross off as many as you can. Different things like sit in the quiet and soak up the sunshine. Just lie do, down and do nothing. Well, what you should get is like give yourself a treat when you cross off, when you get bingo. Hello, wonderful being. We know that with expectations to always be doing... Finding time to rest, to stop and rest can be a challenge. You might want to, you might find yourself seeking out pockets of rest when you can, rewarding yourself with a quiet cup of tea after completing a round of housework or winding down before bed with 20 minutes of reading. But rest is too important to be squeezed in and negotiated. When we rest, all sorts of magical things happen to our body. Rest is the key ingredient replenishing our emotional, mental, and physical health. And gosh, with the stresses and demands of modern life, our ever switched on minds need to unplug more than ever. That's why this buddy box has been thoughtfully curated to arm you with everything you need as you set out on your very own respedition. Ha ha. It says, allow yourself to slow down, be still, and rest. About this buddy box. Ah, rest. That wonderful process of recouping and replenishing. The pause we need for our internal systems to reboot. Yet with the demands of everyday life, most of us stop it. Most of us stopping altogether. Many of us accept fatigue and overwhelm as normal part as normal part of life uh when we have busy jobs roles to live up to within our communities or other commitments our natural urge to push through and be productive can exhaust us with the expectation to always be doing rest is considered indulgent and taking out taking time out for ourselves can make us feel guilty but sometimes dedicating time to do nothing can actually be the most productive thing we can do for ourselves. Just like an active body, an active mind gets tired too. That's why August's Buddy Box is our very own recipe for rest. We've thoughtfully handpicked products that'll help you carve out time to quiet your thoughts, unplug, and allow your mind the time it needs and deserves to recharge and recoup. I think we've gotten stuff from this. Yeah, tea pig. Tea pigs. It's hard to forget that. Lazy name. days. Got a picture of one of those slingback chairs on the front. Yeah. Well, you don't need to open it. You're not gonna I'm going to have tea. To. You don't like tea. I just want to smell it. Lemon and ginger. Okay. Herbal infusion. What's special about this tea? It smells pretty good to me. Mm. Um, there's no match for the ginger kick and refresh refreshing lemon in this all natural caffeine free gingery lemon brew. I mean, I have to admit, I when I have tea. I, I, I don't like herbal tea. You know, it just ends up tasting like nothing to me. But a lot of people do. Like my husband likes it. So this is what's called a tea temple. I always wonder what this is made of, this mesh stuff. Yeah, it's got a little, it's got a little, one of those sling chairs. We used to sit in those when, mm. we used to bring those when we'd watch you play baseball. Mm. So anyway, yeah, so this is nice. Um, definitely nice. It smells yeah. good. Strawberry Looks and like poppy seed natural cleansing bar. Looks like a, the chemical um, abbreviation for something. Oh, nice. That I do like the smell of. Oh, yeah. It's like strawberry and... But it's not like really sweet. It's sweet, but it's not like too sweet. Do you know mm. what I mean? I like that, actually. Uh, yeah. I don't know how I'm supposed to use it or when, but I like it. Yeah, so, I mean, that's a nice soap. You can use that. I don't use bar soaps. I hate them. This is probably better for your... Oh, oh, they you disintegrate. Mean... They, like, they yes, get all they gross. Do. Yeah, they do. I, I hate know. that. I realize that. So this, this looks interesting. Uh, air. Wow. Aromatic dough infused with essential oils. Oh, wait a minute. I think we've had something from these people once before. It was a lavender one. Maybe it was a different company, but it's like thinking putty, but with fragrance. Eucalyptus. Ooh. So air is eucalyptus, peppermint, lavender, hyssop. Oh, I do like this. That actually smells really good. Yeah, it does. Yeah, yeah and this is the stuff. It feels 
like? Hmm. What does it feel like? It's. I don't know. It's yeah, not no, like I know, your I know what you're talking it's about. Like, it's not like a silly putty. Yeah, no, 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 no. It's no. lighter I, than that. I, I know what you're talking about. I know the kind of texture. But, but I not just the texture. I can't place it. Not just the texture. But that the it, way it. It feels like when, yeah. when you compress it, it feels. No, no. I get what you're talking Springier. I don't remember it what. It feels springier than um, than like the, the Aaron's, whatever it is thinking putty mm. it feels like it takes less work mm. do you know what i mean yeah to do it yeah so this is nice we actually um we like these play-doh infused with essential oils mold for up to 10 minutes to release the vapors last for about 30 um times of 10 minutes of use a recipe for rest seven gold foiled cards Ooh. yeah see sensory Shiny. rest social rest Creative rest. Different types of... <laughs> when we're tired, we normally put it down to a lack of sleep. However, sleep isn't the only form of rest we need. In fact, there are seven different types of rest that our human minds and bodies require to function properly. These seven cards will encourage you to reflect and think about which type of energy you are using most. Once you are able to identify the kind of rest you are lacking using the, si the signs and symptoms sections of the cards, you'll be able to actively restore and recover the energy you've poured out. Well, physical rest is kind of a no-brainer, I think, for a lot of people. How about sensory rest? A lot of people don't think of that. Signs and symptoms. Headaches and restlessness. Easily distracted. Loss of focus. Because it's for people who don't have ADHD. Um, sensitive to strong smells, noise, texture, and other types of sensory input. Feelings of overwhelm and agitation. A sense of overall discomfort. So, obviously, this is if you don't normally have, like sensory yeah. processing issues and stuff restoration and recovery so in other words if you see these signs and symptoms limit exposure to your devices throughout the day lower the noise level or go somewhere quiet lower lighting or close blinds allow yourself regular sensory breaks throughout the day what makes you feel most calm how do you uh block smells I don't think that's a good point i don't think you can social rest that's well I mean, if you're an introvert, then you pretty much get those all the time. Social rest, signs of symptoms, feelings of overwhelm due to the demands and expectations of others, feelings of overstimulation and an inability to focus, detachment from others, general low energy or fatigue, reduced performance or involvement. And so for restoration and recovery, limit your engagement with people that demand high levels of attention or energy. Yeah, absolutely. Um, switch off <clears throat> from slash limit exposure to social media or distractions from others where and when you can. Dedicate some time to participating in activities alone. This might be anything from reading to gardening or getting stuck into another hobby <clears throat> that brings you a sense of peace. So I, I like these because you know what? This is the kind of thing that people don't think about a mm -hmm. lot. And to have it laid out like that is really useful. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. <coughs> I mean... I, I like them. Yeah, I like them. A recipe for a wonky day, a mini workbook. What? Oh, good. Some days we wake up and nothing feels right. Our mood and energy is low and all we want to do is crawl back into bed and hibernate. Sometimes we know exactly why we're feeling wonky. Other times um, we haven't a clue. We just woke up like it and can't shake the feeling off. This workbook is full of prompts and thought-provoking activities to encourage self-care on those days, we feel like we have nothing left to give. Some are designed to be filled out now. Some can be saved for when those wonky days crop up le uh, like they do. Keep it simple. The first thing we can do when we're having a wonky time of it is simplify the day ahead as much as possible. Time to think uh, think about what, which things comfort and calm you and what other things you can do to support yourself. Uh, reach in, reach out, sensory comforts, ask for help, self-care checklist, physical energy boundaries box things that light me up all right yeah so this so, is and it goes with the um what are those things it's the recipe for rest obviously mm -hmm. so um that's one of the things i like the most about buddy box is that, that they so frequently do this whole cohesive box i already like this box a lot when we view busyness as a badge of honor it can be so difficult to rest without feeling guilty for doing so 
There was so much pressure to be doing that when we finally find a bit, uh, find a bit of quiet time to ourselves, we can feel as though we are indulging in a luxury. Just, just get MS, and then you have no choice. True. Expectations and accepting fatigue as a normal part of life uh, can skew our perception of the rest. We forget how to, and when we try, we feel as though we are slacking off or wasting precious time. Could be used more productively. Before, because we often link productivity with our self worth, the urge to always fill every minute of the day with something can feel so consuming that we stop stopping altogether. Article is our seven energy pools and how to restore them. Uh, there's physical, mental, emotional, uh, sensory, creative, social, spiritual. So yeah, the the things they're, we saw on the cards. Yeah, they're carrying the um, through. Nixon, the Dutch art of doing nothing. What is Nixon? Oh, N I K S E N. S E N. Not, not yeah. Richard Nixon. How to practice nothing ing. What are the benefits? Uh, yeah. I would love to be able to do that. It's very hard. Oh, same. Okay, I just, I, I, I want to know where this picture on the front came from. I like it. I yeah, think. they do use very nice um, photographs. You know, the place, they do. They actually makes you want to actually, like, be in these places. Like, I... I want to be, I, I want to have like a nice You want to have bed. a random little stem of a I plant have a nice bed. next to the side of a cup of coffee? Uh, it's like, it's like. You want random like sprigs of stuff in your bed? No, what I would love is to be able to actually have like a white couch or white or white covers on my bed or something like that. So, um, yeah, I really like this box. I thought it was it was kind of the most cohesive in a while with the way that, um, you know, the way that stuff tied together. What's nice for them is it's not just a theme where they're like, oh, OK, it's summer. So yeah. let's have it be, you know, heat or whatever. You mm. know, I'm being facetious, but um, they, you know, they put thought into it. That's the, is that the correct word of facetious or the correct meaning why did i say facetious i'm being did i say i'm being facetious yes. i don't know i'm tired i definitely like the box i like the the putty i like the strawberry thing although i'm not going to use it i liked how it smelled i thought the two the activity things those were good uh i mean we've seen other boxes where it's just kind of a very vague stab at yeah you know oh theme. yeah you need to you know um you need to rest and then they don't really this actually literally looks at the different um ways that you can be tired mm. which i've never seen you know what i mean mm. so when i see something in a subscription box that i've never seen before then i'm impressed so this is this definitely is um, um, definitely one of my favorite boxes in the last year. Yeah, yeah, I liked it. Yeah, yeah, but and uh, this is mine because you already have one. I don't. Yeah, you do. Where? Um, we got it like a year and a half ago, maybe. It's I don't have it still. I I have no idea where it is. It does not somewhere, exist anymore. It's like somewhere where your that that external hard drive I gave you is. <laughs> so the void. Yes. Okay. okay, anyways, if you enjoyed this video, uh, give it a like. If you didn't, give it a dislike. Uh, if you'd like to say anything at all, leave in the form of a comment. If you'd like to see more content like this, then you, uh, you're welcome to subscribe. But in any case, uh, we hope that you have a nice day. Take care.